In this short video, let's look at some of the images of barium swallow because a lot of clinical questions are asked these days with images. So this is an image and this is a barium swallow. You can be given a history of uh, dysphagia, halitosis, regurgitation of food content. And this is the barium swallow that will be given to you. A old patient, so you would not want to look out for CA esophagus. But if you see this already marked, you can see this diverticulum. This is your esophagus and there is a diverticulum here okay so this is a uh, you know barium sallow uh, radiograph of Zenker's diverticulum okay let's look at the next uh, image so again a history of dysphagia you know chest pain in a relatively younger patient will be given to you and then you do a bar barium sallow so here what you are seeing is a typical corkscrew appearance okay and this again establishes a diagnosis of diffuse esophageal spasm another you know image which they can give you is this this kind of appearance is called as rosary bead which means you know those normal beads you know malas which we have so this is a rosary bead appearance so this again is a, a diffuse esophageal spasm or nutcracker esophagus in some cases they even give you now so this is again a radiograph of diffuse esophageal spasm the next is Again, a history of uh, you know dysphagia will be given, and here you can see at the lower end, esophagus is literally into a bald beak appearance. Okay, so this is your achalasia cardia. Now here again, I will like to point to you that if you see there is no filling defect, because when a patient comes with dysphagia and you know such kind of here, you may think of CA esophagus. So let's look at this slide. So here again, you can see the narrowing of the distal part of the esophagus, but here you can see Clearly, there are filling defects, irregular filling defects. So, this is a barium solo image of a uh, carcinoma esophagus. Let's look at this image. So, here you can see, you know, filling defect throughout, irregular filling defect throughout the esophagus. Okay, and this is what we it was asked in a, uh, shown in exam. Also, it is esophageal candidiasis. So, these are important barium solo images which you should uh, you know know for your examination. Thank you.